Jehovah na kushukuru Father I bless you Father I bless you Father I bless you Namshukuru Mungu kwa vile amekuwa mwema sana Siko natarajia kama event ya leo watu watahudhuria hivi lakini watu wamekuwa wengi mpaka wengine wametolewa nje wakaambiwa itabidi wajipange ndio waingie vizuri na naona hata governor wa kitu alifika asubuhi na tunaendelea vizuri sana nashukuru Mungu na facility wake Edith Malombe na pia tunatarajia wageni wengi wengi zaidi na pia uh, Evelyn Mudoka amefika na tunamsubiria Anastasia Mukabwa kia tukivue naye pia ameniambia kwa njia Viki Kitonga kwa ndani Wilberforce kwa ndani so nashukuru Mungu na wasanii wengi ni wengi sana and I thank God for everything sasa tunaweza kutana ndani tukaona vile mambo yalivyo huko ndani maana huku nje mambo yamenoga twende ndani sasa
Mambo ni kama hayo sasa. Upe makofi tafadhali 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 kila mtu. Thank you Jesus. Jina lako Bwana libarikiwe. Na Yesu akaone kama unoni. Wewe ni Mungu mwema. Na kusujudia Jehova. Jina lako libarikiwe Mungu ishie milele. Walinitoa kwa shida Bwana. Kwandu wasio wako nundu watayo wako Mumbie ngoyo tulika ndevye wia wako Guma itata nyengwila nundu wanele wako Miela mifuduta kwa umiti utahivi nyaki Nati kwandu wasio wako nundu watayo wako Eka ngwini ee kutumuche yeso Bikithila nicha usumbi wia senguma Wanu misye dhinani yesu kwa umani yee Ndaya kiyota kwa wambiti ye mwana Kusumuche yesu Biki vila nicha usumi wiyo senguma Wanu misia dinani Yesu nga ulanike Ndaya kiyota kwa wambiti ye mwana Chino na kogwana libarikiwe Wewe ni mungu mwema Umeja wana upendo jehova Hiyo senguma Haya tumusaidia kuimba basi ya kenda kumaliza Hiyo senguma Hiyo senguma Hiyo senguma Hiyo senguma Hiyo senguma Hiyo senguma Yosengumba. We bless you. 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 We let us worship the Lord in the mighty name of Jesus. This is the doing of the Lord. This is not a doing of any man. Just worship the Lord. Just worship the Lord, everybody. Just worship the Lord. Lift up your hands and worship the Lord. Everybody help us to worship the Lord. Help us to give him praise. Help us to give him praise. Help us to give the Lord praise. Help us to give the Lord praise. In this house, somebody somewhere praise the Lord. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, the son of the living God. Father, we bless you. Father, we honor you. Father, we say you are worthy. This is your doing, King of glory. This is not a work of a man, oh God. We are here to connect back to you, mighty Redeemer. We are here, King of glory, to glorify you for what you have done, mighty Redeemer. Yes, we are here, King of glory, to say you receive all the glory. Oh, yes, you receive Lord. all the power. You receive all the honor, mighty Redeemer. Thank you for what you have done, my Father. And thank you for what you will continue to do. Thank you for this great ministry, mighty Redeemer. You, we Jesus. came today to say thank you. Oh, thank we came to dedicate it unto you. We mm. came because we know the next level is in your hands, mighty Redeemer. We bless you, mighty God. We honor you, King of glory. Jesus. Thank you, mighty Father. Thank Come you, on, somebody Jesus. put your hands together for Jesus oh, in the you, mighty Lord. name of Jesus Christ, the Son of the living God. Thank you, mighty Father. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. I want us in the mighty name of Jesus to do what brought us here. And for a few minutes, I will be doing what brought us here. We appreciate what you are doing. 
uh, my son, this is a great ministry. And just before we pray for him, I would ask us to sit down. I want to say one, two, three things. Then we are going to bless this ministry, which is touching the nations of the world, which is touching this nation, which is touching Africa, and it is touching the nations of the world in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, the Son of the living God. Thank you, mighty Father. Hallelujah. Amen. My name is Reverend Rhoda. Uh, this is my son. We have worked with him since the time he sang the first song. And I wanted to know that he's a very faithful uh, member of our church. And he has supported the ministry, especially through evangelism. He's a great evangelist. Amen. And so we don't take him for granted. I know we are, all of us are here because he has been serving God faithfully in the mighty name of Jesus Christ the son of the living God. And I want to say that God is a faithful God. He does not begin a work if he's not going to accomplish. I also want to honor and uh, very humbly as I stand before our mom in this nation, uh, Reverend Josephine, we love you so much. We love you, mom. We are humble to be in this pulpit. We also want to thank God for the servants of God in the house. Pastors in the house. We appreciate you so much. May the Lord bless you mightly. I also want to appreciate God for the governor. All protocols in this house observed. Uh, uh, zote. And every fan, those people who are here because they like, they like this ministry. And our church which is also here. We serve God together with Steve. And we thank God so much. So without uh, 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 taking more time, I want to read the word in the book of Esther chapter 4 from 13 to 14. Pastor Helen will read these powerful words and then we are going to anoint my, my son. Steve atapakwa. Nasoma kutoa kitabu cha Esther uh, chapter 4 verse 13 and 14. Then Mordecai commanded to answer Esther, Dig not with thyself that thou shalt escape in the king's house more than all the Jews. For if thou altogether holdest thy peace at this time, then shall their enlargement and deliverance ari arise to the Jews from another place. But thou and thy father's house shall be destroyed. And who knoweth whether thou art had come at the kingdom for such a time as this. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I want to talk about serving your purpose. You, there is no way God can anoint you for nothing. Every time God gives you his oil, it is for a purpose, it is for a certain purpose. And so you must be careful to use your oil properly. This is Mordecai talking to Esther. I want you to no, nataka ujue. That Esther had just come into the kingdom. The reason why Esther came in is because there is another queen called Vashti who never knew her purpose. I want you to know there is no time God will anoint you without a purpose. There is a purpose and a reason why God is going to give you favor. It is not a small thing to gather people the way we are gathered. There is the purpose of God. And so I want to encourage each and every one of us that Mordecai spoke to Esther. He said, Esther, you can fear the king. You can go the worldly way. You can do things like other people. You can fear to go before the king. But you don't know. Maybe God has anointed you at a time like this for the salvation of the Jews. For the salvation of the Jews. If the anointing of God upon your life is from God, that anointing must be used for the salvation of the dying world. Let me tell you something. Even 
if God has given you a song, hata kama Mungu amekupa wimbo, even if it is a message, hata kama ni ujumbe, there is no time. Hakuna wakati. God will anoint you. Mungu atakupa for nothing. Bure. And so I speak to my son. Kwa hivyo naongea na wana wangu. You are in the kingdom. Uko kwa ufalme. For such a time like this. Kwa wakati kama huu. For a purpose. Kwa kusudi. And so number one. Kwa hivyo nambari ya kwanza. You've got to guard. Lazima uchunge. That which God has given you. Kila Mungu amekupea. It must be guarded. Lazima ilindwe. Guard your strength. Linda nguvu zako. Listen to me children of God. Nisikize watoto wa Mungu. We are living in a time. Tunaishi nyakati. When people have forgotten. Watu wamesahau. That the oil was God's oil. Na kama mafuta yalikuwa ya Mungu. We are living in a time. Tunaishi nyakati. That people have forgotten. Watu wamesahau. That the favor. Na kama kibali. Was God's favor. Ilikuwa ni ya Mungu. We are living in a time. Tunaishi nyakati. When people have forgotten. Watu wamesahau. That the prosperity. Na kama ufanisi. Was God's prosperity. Ulikuwa ni wa Mungu. And so every time. Kwa hivyo kila wakati. You find yourself. Unajipata. God lifting you. Mungu akikuinua. You better remember. Nafadhali ukumbuke. It is the work of God. Ni kazi ya Mungu. It is not the work of a man. Si kazi ya mwanadamu. And so it is not so that. Kwa hivyo sio. People can see you and salute you. Ili watu wakuone wakusalimie. It is so that. Ndio sababu. You can deliver. Upeane. The dying world. Ukomba wa the dying world. Ulimwengu unaisha. So many people. Kwa hivyo watu wengi. Want to be heard. Wanataka wasikike. The way you are heard. Vile unasikika. But God. Lakini Mungu. Has not opened. Hajafungua. The ears of the people. Masikio ya watu. To hear them. Wasikie hao. So when people can hear you. Watu wakikusikia. When people can hear your song. Watu wakisikia wimbo wako. When people can hear your message. Watu wakisikia ujumbe wako. Just remember. Kumbuka. It is God's oil. Ni mafuta ya Mungu. And guard the oil. Na ulinde mafuta. My son guard the oil. Mwanangu linda mafuta. Guard your oil. Linda mafuta. There is a purpose. Kuna kusudi. Why God has given you ukambani. Mungu amekupea ukambani. There is a purpose. Kuna kusudi. Why God has given you this nation. Kwa nini Mungu amekupa taifa hili? There is a purpose. Kuna kusudi. Why God is taking you to the nations of the world. Kwa nini Mungu anakupeleka mataifa ya ulimwengu? God your strength. Linda nguvu zako. God your strength. Linda nguvu zako. In the time of Samson. Kwa wakati wa Samson. The strength of Samson. Nguvu za Samson was in the seven locks. Ilikuwa katika zile nywele saba. It was in the seven locks. Ilikuwa kwa zile nywele saba. When he misbehaved. Alipokosa tabia. When he gave himself. Alipojipeana. To the women of this world. Kwa wanawake wa ulimwengu. When he gave himself. Alipojipeana. To the fame of this world. Kwa sifa za dunia. When he gave himself. Alipojipeana. The strength was removed. Nguvu zikatolewa. I'm here to say. Niko hapa kusema. To each and every servant of God. Kwa kila mtumishi wa Mungu. Let us guard the strength. Wacha tulinde nguvu. Let us guard the strength. Wacha tulinde nguvu. Everybody can sing. Kila mtu anaweza imba. But people are not listening to us. Lakini watu hawatusikii. Why is it that God? Kwa nini Mungu? Has given to listen to you. He has given men to listen to you. Amepea watu wa kusikiza. Don't allow the enemy. Usiruhusu shetani. To save your air. Don't allow the enemy to save your air. I say don't allow the enemy to save your air. Don't allow the enemy to touch your strength and begin to mishandle you. Stay on course. Stay on course. Herod said to the wise men, when you see the child, come and tell me so that I will go and worship the baby. Ili niende nimwabudu. Herod never wanted to worship the baby. Herod hakutaka kuabudu mtoto. He wanted to destroy. Halitaka kuajibu. He wanted to destroy. Halitaka kuharibu. And I want you to know. Nataka ujue. That in our time. Na kama nyakati zetu. They are Herods. Kuna maherode. And they are saying. Na wanasema. We love you. Tunakupenda. They are saying. Wanasema. We love you. Tunakupenda. They like you like so much. Wana wanakupenda sana. Be careful. Jichunge. Don't pass through the Herod's place. Usipitie njia ya Herode. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Don't pro- pass through that way. Usipitie hiyo njia. I came to say. Nilikuja kusema. Stay on course. Ukae kwa kusudi lako. I want to say again. Nataka kusema tena. Remember the source. Kumbuka mahali umetoka. We knew you because you are with God. Tulikujua maana ulikuwa na Mungu. That is why we met. Ndio maana tulikutana. Everyone you have met here. Kila mmoja umekutana yeye hapa. They never knew you. Hawakukujua until God found you. Mpaka Mungu akakupata. Everyone you see in this congregation they never knew you hawakukujua until god found you mpaka mungu akakupata god is the source mungu ndiye chanzo of your strength ya nguvu zako of your blessings ya baraka zako remember the source kumbuka mwanzo in such a time like this na wakati kama huu as we pour oil on you tunapokumwagia mafuta i want you to know nataka ujue that there are places you have never been kuna mahali ujaifika the lord is going to take you there bwana atakupeleka people you have never met watu hujakutana 
going to take you to them. Bwana atakupeleka kwao. Remember the source. Kumbuka chanzo. If you find that you are not in the source. Ukipata hauja huko pale. Stop singing for one week. Acha kuimba wiki moja. Go and look for Jesus. Enda utafute Yesu. Tell the Lord I am not hearing you. Amwambie Bwana sikusikii. Don't sing like the people of the world. Usiimbe kama watu wa dunia. The source of your songs is God. Acha kwa sanduku zako ni Mungu. Seek the Lord. Imba Mungu. Seek the Lord. Imba Mungu. I came today. Nilikuja leo to tell you. Nikwambia yes. go back on your knees. Rudi kwa magoti. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Remember your soul. Na kumbuke chanzo chako. Remember the altar. Kumbuka madhabahu. That is the place of power. Hapo ndio mahali pa nguvu. That is the place where you can be refreshed. Hapo ndio unaweza kufukuza nguvu. When everybody was not there. Wakati hakukua na mtu. God was there. Mungu alikuwa hapa. When they never knew you. Wakati hawakukujua. God knew you. Mungu alikujua. This anointing Uma, ama so not take you away usikutoe from the source kwa chanzo Amen. the source of your blessing chanzo cha baraka zako is the lord god almighty ni bwana mungu mkuu and because we are on the altar maana tuko kwa madhabahu we want to return you to the source tunataka kukurudisha kwa chanzo we want to rededicate your life tukupeane tena we want to rededicate your ministry tupende huduma yako tena we want to tell the lord tumwambie bwana it is not about the fans sikuuzu watu these fans follow you because we are with god hawa watu wanakufuata maana kwa mungu try to stay without god jaribu kukaa bila mungu you will never see them hautawaona but god lakini mungu i pray for you na kuombea i pray for you na kuombea that you will stay in the source kwamba utakaa kwa chanzo the source of your blessing chanzo cha baraka zako somebody shout hallelujah mtu aseme hallelujah somebody shout hallelujah mtu aseme hallelujah somebody shout hallelujah mtu aseme hallelujah we are going to ask uh, steve to to remember the source namuuliza steve akumbuke chanzo as much as you came excited that yesu nde kombe kama vile umekuja ukifurahia kwamba Yesu ndeko mbe. I want you to know without God. Nataka ujue kama bila Mungu. You will not have heard that voice. Hongesikia hiyo sauti. And so the source matters. Kwa hivyo chanzo kina ni matters. Chanzo kina When you drive an aeroplane. Kama unaendesha ndege. Live alone the car. Waachana na gari. Remember your source. Kumbuka chanzo. When you travel to the nations. Ukienda kwa mataifa. Remember you are there because of God. Kumbuka uko pale kwa sababu ya Mungu. Don't allow women. Usiruhusu wanawake. Don't allow money. Usiruhusu pesa. Don't allow fame. Usiruhusu sifa to remove you from the source zikutoe kwa chanzo i see musicians contemplating i am going to sing secular i am going to sing the gospel there is nothing like contemplating the secular or the gospel it is the gospel ni injili if you started with god kama ulianza na mungu it is the devil who tells you to sing secular ni shetani anakuambia uimbe nyimbo to hell with the devil shetani aende kuzimu to hell with the devil haenda kuzimu it will be the gospel itakuwa ni injili that is how you continue na hivyo ndio utaendelea that is how you grow hivyo ndio utakuwa that is how you will be blessed hapo hivyo ndio utabarikiwa hallelujah hallelujah so i want to ask uh, the pastors in the house nataka niulize wachungaji kwa nyumba and our mom na mama yetu she is going to come atakuja and because this 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 function na sababu huu mkutano was so that we can we can we can raise an altar again ni ndipo sasa tuinue madhabahu tena to raise an altar again tuinue madhabahu tena that is why we are here ndio maana tuko hapa that was the most important thing hiyo ndio jambo la maana zaidi be, be, together with the money we have brought pamoja na pesa tumeleta the most important thing jambo la maana zaidi was to get our son ni tulete mwana wetu back on the on the altar to the source tena kwa chanzo and ask god to lift him to another level na tuulize mungu amuinue kiwango kingine the next kingine. level of of singing kiwango kingine cha kuimba is going to be a, a, a level where people are going to sing and sinners are going to come to the kingdom ni kuimba ambao utaimba na wenye dhambi wataokoka and so that is where we are na hapo ndipo tipo tupo in the mighty name of jesus kwa jina kula yesu So I want to ask you to kneel down. Nataka nikuulize upige magoti. Then as we we bless these songs, na tunapobariki hizi nyimbo, we want to pray first. Nataka tuombe kwanza. Raise you with an anointing. Tukuinue na mafuta. I'm sure we have other servants of God. Niko na kia kuna watumishi wa Mungu wako katikati yetu. You can come over. Naweza kuja hapa mbele. You can come over we speak a blessing. Unaweza kuja hapa mbele tunene baraka. In the mighty name of Jesus. Kwa jina kuu la Yesu. In the mighty name of Jesus. Kwa jina kuu la Yesu. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Pastors just come. Wachungaji kujeni. Please come I'm waiting for you. Kujeni na wangojea. Pastors are the people who step on the river. Watungaji ndio watu wanaingia kwa mto kwa. And the river stops flowing. Na mto unaacha kutiririka. Because they have authority. Maana wako na mamlaka. From the Lord Jesus Christ. Kutoka bwana Yesu Kristo. From the Lord Jesus Christ. Kutoka bwana Yesu Kristo. So we want to pray. Tunataka tuombe. And rededicate this ministry. Na tupeane hii huduma. Once again. Mara tena. I said once again. Nasema mara tena. To the Lord Jesus Christ. Kwa bwana Yesu Kristo. It is on the altar. Ni kwa madhabahu tu. Where battles are going to be fought. Ambapo vita vitapigana. They will never be fought in the internet. Hazitapigana kwa mtu 
mtandao. Stop fighting in the internet. Wacha kupigana kwa mtandao. And just go to your source. Na uende kwa chanzo. And to the Lord. Na umwambie Bwana. You said when they come in one way. Ulisema wakija njia moja. They will be scattered in seven directions. Watatawanyishwa njia saba. So we want to just pray for our son. Tunataka tuombe mwanetu. And we thank God because Reverend is here. Tunashukuru Mungu maana kasisi yako hapa. He's going to pray for my son. Na ataombea mwanangu. Send him, send him to the nations of the world. Amtume kwa mataifa ya ulimwengu. She has all the anointing. Akona upako wote. And we honor her in this nation. Atunamheshimu kwa taifa hili. In the mighty name of Jesus. Kwa jina kula Yesu. Amen. Right, shall we all pray? Tuombe. Our mighty loving heavenly Father. Baba wetu mwaminifu wa mbinguni. We bow in your presence again this afternoon. Tunainama kwa uwepo wako adhuri ya leo. Because of the gifts that you have given to men. Kwa milango ambayo umepeana kwangu. We thank you for this young man. Tunakushukuru kwa ukidhana mdogo. That you have gifted with a beautiful voice. Na kama umempa kibali kizuri cha sauti nzuri. You have gifted him with the ability to compose songs. Umempa kipawa cha kutunga nyimbo. And Father you have given him a platform in this nation. Na umempatia mahali pa kusimama kwa taifa hii. And in other nations of the world. Na kwa mataifa mengine ya ulimwengu. While he is still young O oh God. Akiwa mchanga ewe Mungu. He may not have been known. Pengine hajajua. He may be like a David. Anaweza kuwa kama Daudi. Who was tending sheep in the field. Aliyekuwa anachunga kondoo pale jangwani. But God you had your hand on him. Lakini Mungu ulikuwa na mkono wake juu yako. And it is because of that that we are gathered together today. Na ni kwa sababu hiyo tumekutana hapa siku ya leo. To recognize what you have done for Kasolo. Kutambua kile umemfanyia Kasolo. For indeed it doesn't matter to you. Kwa ukweli haijalishi kwako. Where we have come from. Mali tumetoka. You can lift from the dust. Unaweza inua kutoka kwa mavumbi. And you can raise someone to dine with a princess. Na unaweza inua wakule na wakuu. And therefore in the name of Jesus. Na leo kwa jina la Yesu. We want to separate Stephen. Tunataka kutenganisha Stephen. From the rest of the world singers. Kutoka kwa waimbaji wa ulimwengu. And we want to declare. Na tunataka kutangaza. He will see about Jesus. Yes. Ataimba kuhusu Yesu. He will not sing about men. Ataimba kuhusu wanadamu. But he will sing about Jesus. Lakini ataimba kuhusu Yesu. Because the only Jesus. Sababu ni Yesu tu. That have lifted him. Ambaye amemuinua. From where he was unknown. Kutoka mahali ambapo hakujulikani. The place where he is now known. Kufika mahali amefika anajulikana. I commend this young man to you. Nampeana huyu kijana kwako. In the name of Jesus. Kwa jina la Yesu. I pray loving father. Naomba baba wa upendo that you will protect his life na kama utabaifadhi maisha yake keep him away from the last of the eye umuifadhi kwa 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 tamaa ya last of the flesh tamaa za mwili and the pride of life na kiburi cha uhai when you give him success o god ukimpa ufanisi ewe mungu i pray that he will never forget na kama atasahau where you have brought him from mali ameitoa i pray that you remain humble naomba kama atabaki kunyenyekea because god you have said in your word Mwana umesema katika neno lako Mungu. You resist the proud. Na kama wale wenye kiburi unawatukuza. You give grace to the humble. Lakini unawapa neema wale wenye nyekevu. Therefore I pray Father. Yes. Leo naomba Bwana. That you will protect him. Na kama utamlinda. I pray that the songs that he sings. Naomba nyimbo anazoimba will not be entertainment only. Azitakuwa kufurahisha tu. But they, they will appeal to the hearts of men. Lakini zitaingia kwa mioyo ya watu. In the name of Jesus. Katika jina la Yesu. And as people hear the those songs no, Jehovah na watu wanaposikiliza nyimbo Jehovah they will be drawn unto you watavutwa kwako i pray in the name of jesus naomba kwa jina la yesu that the spirit of the living god ya kama roho ya mungu anaishi it was in david ama yes. ilikuwa kwa daudi will be upon kasolo itakuwa juu ya kasolo in the name of jesus kwa jina la yesu i pray the songs will come na kama nyimbo zitakuja when he is traveling akisafiri yes. songs will come from heaven nyimbo zitakuja kutoka mbinguni when he is sleeping akiwa amelala songs will come to him nyimbo zitakuja kwake wherever he will be mahali popote atakuwa he will not be able to contain himself hataweza kujifunga the songs will continue coming maana nyimbo zitaendelea kuja from the throne of god kwa kwa kitu cha mungu and he will sing the song na taimba hizo nyimbo for the glory of god utukufu wa Mungu I pray for favor Naomba kibali I pray for grace Naomba neema I pray for prosperity yes. Naomba ufanisi and your divine protection yes. Na ulinzi wa kiungo upon his life Juu ya maisha yake I declare today Natangaza leo Kasolo will not go Kasolo hataenda Away of all young men Vijana 
vijana wa dawa been lifted in this country ambao wanatembea kwa dunia hii have forgotten their god na wasao mungu wao he will not be among them hata kuwa kimbadhi wao he will be separated lakini atatengwa for the kingdom of god kwa ufalme wa mungu and for the glory of god na utukufu wa mungu sustain him oh god yes. uhifadhi wa mungu and preserve his life na uhifadhi maisha yake father may he bring glory na baba utokea utukufu your wonderful name katika jina lako takatifu we bless him tunambariki and we speak life na tunanena uhai and good health na afya njema upon his life juu ya maisha yake even when you will come of age na cha ukiku when he desires to get married akitaka kuoa i pray in the name of jesus naomba kwa jina la yesu you will connect him utamuunganisha with a godly woman na mwanamke wa mungu that to add value ambaye yuko na thamani into his life kwa maisha yake and into his ministry na katika huduma yake the glory of god kwa utukufu wa mungu thank you father asante baba for what you are going to do for him kwa kile unaenda kumtendea we rejoice with him tunafurahi naye because of what is yet to come kwa kile kinakuja and we give you the glory na tunakupa utukufu and we give you the praise na tunakupa sifa in jesus name kwa jina la yesu amen amen and amen amen jesus Now father yes, yes baba as David was anointed by Samuel kama vile Daudi alipakwa na Samuel we yes, pour oil on yes, Stephen tunawaga yes, mafuta kwa Stephen in yes. the name of the father kwa jina la baba son yes, and the holy spirit la mwana na roho mtakatifu to the glory of god kwa utukufu wa mungu we separate him tunakutenga for the kingdom of god kwa ufamo wa mungu in jesus name kwa jina la yesu amen 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 thank you jesus asante yesu and so in the name of jesus kwa jina la yesu we have these two albums tuko na album mbili it's one thank you it's one album ni album moja it is called yesu ndekombe inaitwa yesu ndekombe yesu ndekombe yesu ndekombe you cannot compete with jesus hawezi pigana na yesu he can never fight with men hawezi shindana na watu he, he cannot be given competition hawezi shindana na watu this is what kasolo is sending to the world and I, to the nations hivi ndio kasolo anatuma kwa ulimwengu na mataifa right now as we are standing here na sasa hivi tunaposimama hapa in the mighty name of jesus kwa jina kula yesu i declare natangaza yesu ndeko Yes, yes, in this nation pataifa hii in this nation pataifa hii in africa in africa in the nations of the world kama taifa ya ulimwengu i send this song na tuma huu wimbo power na nguvu and authority na mamlaka and anointing na upako to the nations of the world kama taifa ya ulimwengu in the mighty name of jesus kwa jina kula yesu come on stand up and shout yes ndeko mbe simama na useme yesu ndeko mbe to the air tunaachilia kwa hali nasi to the atmosphere tunaachilia kwa anga we declare tunatangaza they will sing it wataimba wimbo kwa taifa hii and even people who don't understand this language na hata watu walewi hii have sent it to them tumeituma kwao and they will love it na wanaipenda and they will say we want this one watasema tunataka hiyo in jesus name kwa jina la yesu excel excel ufanikiwe excel ufanikiwe excel ufanikiwe enter doors with this song ingia milango na huu wimbo enter in